Fool us once, Lidl. Shame on us. Fool us twice. You're dead to us! <laughs> Welcome to Fine Dining Fall. I'm Jen. And I'm Drew. Today we're going to try something new and let you know whether the dining is fine or should be left behind. So what's on the menu? So today we have a redo from Lidl. Lidl! We love Lidl! So you may remember that we reviewed the pumpkin spice popcorn from there. That did not turn out well. We were not big fans. So today because several fine diners told us that we got it wrong. They did. And that we should have gotten the maple popcorn. How were we to know? So today we are going to review the maple drizzled kettle corn from Lidl. Sounds like a good idea. Fool us once, Lidl. Shame on us. Fool us twice. You're dead to us. <laughs> Okay, so this one is also a fall flavor. It smells delicious. Very mapley. But if you remember, so did the other one. It did. So, I mean, I'm skeptical, I'll be honest. I have cautious optimism. Why would these other fine diners lie to our faces? Well, that's true. They did say, no, no, you have to get this maple one. Yeah. So, here we go. We're going to try it. Okay. Let's get a couple of pieces. Ooh. <laughs> I can't even do that. Ooh. Sticky. Yeah, it is sticky. Cheers. Cheers. Okay. So, it is better. It's better. It's definitely crunchier than the other one, which had zero crunch. Right. The other one was just... I mean, perfectly stale tasting. Yes. It was the saddest popcorn you've ever tasted. Yeah. But the thing about the pumpkin spice one is when we opened the bag, it smelled so good. Mm -hmm. And then we put it in our mouths. It was super soft and it just turned us off. Yes. This smelled good. Brought more crunch. Um, but it's still kind of soft. It's soft-ish. The other one tasted like it had been left out for a year. Mm -hmm. This one tastes like it's been left out for like four days. So it still has some <laughs> crunch. And the maple tastes really good. So it's kind of compensating for... Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, you're never going to get the crunch that you're going to get from making fresh-made popcorn. We're not looking for that. But it's got to have some sort of a popcorn and crunch. It's one of the reasons... Well, yeah, we it's a crunchy snack. Yes. Um, but to plug our one of our other favorite stores, Aldi, their flavored popcorns have more crunch. They do. So I think maybe we were where we have been a little spoiled by the flavored popcorns from Aldi because they've all had more of a crispness to it. We visited the top of the mountain, and now everything <laughs> else. Right. Is... <laughs> so, okay. So with this. It has more of an icing type of feeling on yeah, it. Yeah, that's the sticky on there. Yeah, it feels sort of like that. Well, it says maple drizzled. Sort of gives me a feeling of like glazed. Glazed, yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> glazed. More than the pumpkin spice one because the pumpkin spice one didn't have that on it. No, and speaking of glazed, this actually has more maple flavor than those Krispy Kreme maple donuts that we made. <laughs> yeah. So. Yeah. They, um, but I'll say that it's not as strong of a maple flavor as it is a smell. Yes. Right. The taste is more just sweet. It is sweet. And it has like a slight hint of maple or some kind of fallish flavor. Yeah. It's evoking fall quite well. Yeah. So we should give it a rating. We should. Okay. So I'm going to give it... A six and a half. Okay. I'm going to go seven just because I'm always arbitrary. Mm -hmm. And it has more crunch than the other. If we hadn't had the other one first, which made the bar so freaking low. Yeah. But this is munchy enough. 
we'll totally eat this. The other bag, we were not going to eat. That went straight into the trash. This yeah, one, we're going to eat. The other one, yeah, exactly. <laughs> this one, I could feed, I could eat more of it for yeah. sure. It definitely has enough to keep me going back yes. <laughs> to the plate, to the bag. <laughs> so that is good, I guess. It's crunchy, sweet, ballish. You open it, it smells good. That would work as a potpourri. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So I think if you like maple, you'll like this. Yeah. I mean, if you like maple and you like popcorn. Well, yeah. Don't right. like popcorn. What are you doing here? <laughs> right. And it's not, um, it's not super holly or anything. Oh, no. Uh, I like it. I like it pretty good. Yeah. And how's that? If you've ever had Angie's dessert popcorns, mm -hmm. it has that little bit of um, that icing feel to it. Angie's is crunchier. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Angie's is crunchier. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So if you are lucky enough to be near a Lidl, you should try it. Totally should. Yep. I think that you should try this definitely over the pumpkin spiced variety. Don't get the pumpkin spice. Right. So we'll see you next time on Fine Dining. Fine Dining, y'all.